So how was your drive? Uh, pretty awesome. I had the full off-road experience, which I wasn't expecting actually. It was pretty hardcore. It was like genuinely off-road. I'm confused though because your car came back so clean. You must be kidding. No, my, my so car started off white <laughs> uh, and, and came back a certain shade of brown. Yeah, okay, yeah, maybe, cool. maybe a little bit. It did yeah. rain a bit. So we, we encountered some kind of freak monsoon type of action, but arguably you would think that coming here in the rain would sort of dampen the spirits a mm. bit, but really because it's an SUV and we were doing off-road, it was actually perfect. Isn't it quite a bizarre concept though? I found it very strange being in a Lamborghini in that kind of terrain. Yes. It just didn't quite compute. Well, it was, it was like, weird. Sometimes I'd be driving and I'd be going on this off-road terrain <laughs> and I'd glance down and see this Lamborghini logo and the <laughs> juxtaposition of those two things took me a while to gel. But great experience, incredibly fast as well. Incredibly fast. Really? Did you get used to how many different settings there were? It, yes, I didn't try them all, <laughs> but you have to flip through them all them. to get back. Okay, that's it. Okay. Go on. <laughs> Snow, neve. Neve. Okay, so you're terror. doing it in reverse. Yeah, okay, I've missed out. I, I, don't, I can't remember what's in between gravel. Something to do with sand. I can't remember. Oh, yeah. So. <laughs> yeah. You can calibrate all of the settings yeah, to your individual sort of preferences, as it were. And did you Which also, cool. uh, obviously from a practical sense, being mm -hmm. a female, always yeah. carry a lot of luggage, did you explore the boot? No. So I was co concentrating on the like vast amounts of torque and like you know over 600 horsepower. Okay, that was that yeah, was, was quite fun yeah, too. So, cool. That was good. <laughs>